pigs. As you can see, the pigs are growing now. We have got a little bit of more porkers now, and we're still having a problem of them destroying their, their way they stay. So it's something that is in the plan of being fixed. It's not something that we have forgotten, but it will be done in due time. So the pig that we were expecting that should be firing this month has actually yet to fire it, and we were actually shocked that the one that we were thinking would only be giving birth next month actually gave birth about four day yeah, about four or five days ago so the one that has gave birth and it's actually firing for its first time it gave birth to four piglets i'm uh, sorry to seven little piglets so this is the one that is just ferried recently it gave seven piglets and out of the seven it's only one male so we have got quite a lot of females from here but um, as you can see it's probably lunch time i don't know which meal period i can call it but they're actually enjoying themselves um, drinking milk and all that so the pig numbers are actually growing whilst we're trying to really get to reduce them and zim is not getting any better the cost of food has actually just gone up in the past few days. Every first, it's the maize in Zimbabwe that went up. So automatically, when the maize went up, it meant obviously the feed was going to go up. So today, when I tried buying feed, it has gone up. So the bad part about it is as much as it has gone up, also for you to then increase your prices makes it very difficult. But these are the challenges that we are facing as, as farmers and it's not looking any better and also as i said this year it's been a bad bad weather so we don't know what is going to happen with the with due to the rain so just to give you an update of the pigs